Before the discovery of Australia, people in the old world were convinced that all swans were white, an unassailable belief as it seemed completely confirmed by empirical evidence. The sighting of the first black swan might have been an interesting surprise for a few scientists, but that is not where the significance of the story lies. Researchers have developed electronic blood vessels that can be actively tuned to address subtle changes in the body after implantation. The blood vessels made of a metal polymer conductor membrane that's flexible and biodegradable mimic natural blood vessels, were conductive in vitro experiments, and were able to effectively replace key arteries in rabbits. The provision of accurate and authoritative statistical information strengthens our society. It provides a basis for decisions to be made on public policy, such as determining electoral boundaries and where to locate schools and hospitals. It also allows businesses to know their market, grow their business, and improve their marketing strategies by targeting their activities appropriately.
Our field teams have come across fish in distress or even eel stranded and it is simply that the waters got too hot. Often dissolved oxygen concentrations go down as water temperature increases and animals may seek refuge outside the water, or in fact they may be stranded if the water's evaporating very quickly. It is precisely in observing the intertwinings of success and failure that chasing the flame makes its greatest mark. With piercing insight and relentless logic, it reveals the pitfalls of international politics and details an intricate struggle between individual and institution. It haunts us with the poignant truth that even a great man can do only so much to reinvent the world. A new study comprehensively reveals how civil wars impact wildlife in countries affected by conflict. Researchers found that the main impacts of civil wars on native mammals are often indirect, ultimately arising from institutional and socioeconomic changes, rather than from direct military tactics.
As a historian, if you really want to understand the sensibilities of those who lived in the past, you must be like a novelist and get into the skins of your characters and think and feel as they do. You are asked to imagine what it's like to be a peasant in medieval times, asking the sort of questions a peasant might ask. What the writer is saying is that a historian needs imaginative sympathy with ordinary people in the past. The climate for doing business improved in Egypt more than in any other country last year, according to a global study that revealed a wave of company-oriented reforms across the Middle East. The World Bank rankings, which look at business regulations, also showed that the pace of business reforms in Eastern Europe was overtaking East Asia. Scientists have determined that the atmosphere above the planet Uranus is full of a gas that makes the distant planet smell like rotten eggs. According to NASA, a global research team dissected infrared light from Uranus and found hydrogen sulfide in the planet's top clouds. Hydrogen sulfide is a colorless, flammable, extremely hazardous gas with a rotten egg smell, according to the Occupational Health and Safety Administration.
Once you've picked a general topic for your paper, you need to come up with a thesis. Your thesis is the main and focal point of your paper and it's the position you'll take on your particular topic. Formulating a strong thesis is one of the most important things you need to do to ace your paper. Virtual assistants have become increasingly sophisticated and more human-like since the days when Clippy asked if you needed help with your document. These assistants are intended to make programs and apps easier to use, but research suggests that human-like virtual assistants may actually deter some people from seeking help on tasks that are supposed to measure achievement.